Hello, I'm Tracy Sorensen. I'm a casual teacher at Charles Sturt University in video production and journalism and I'm really happy to be helping you to put together your video diaries. Uh, there's a few little things I want to point out. The first one is light. If you just look at this screen at the moment you can see that my face is lit uh, that's because I've got a, a lamp, uh, just an ordinary old bedside lamp sitting beside the computer. I'm just going to turn it off and show you the difference it makes. That's me without the lamp on and uh, there's just not quite enough light on the face so I do recommend, here we go, there's the light back on using a light. The other way to get light on the face might be to position your uh, computer or laptop so that the light from say an open window like the one I've got behind me is um, is coming directly onto the face. That's another way to ensure enough light. Another really important issue is sound. Um, the built-in microphone on your computer should be fine but you really want to make sure that you're in a quiet room. We definitely don't need, for example, uh, background music or the television or radio or you know dogs barking and children squealing or whatever. A little bit of that is fine, that's kind of atmospheric, but basically the room should be as quiet as you as you can make it. Uh, that way you'll ensure good sound. Another really important um, issue is stability, getting a nice stable shot. We don't really want uh, this sort of thing. There we go, I'm just kind of jiggling my laptop around. Uh, but if you're doing sort of handheld video recording it can sometimes uh, look very shaky. Um, so you you want to go for as much stability as possible. Um, if you're using a, a laptop or a desktop computer like this then obviously the, um, the shot is nice and stable. If you're not then try something like um, putting your iPhone on top of a stack of books or some other way of getting um, stability into your shot. Okay, if you do those three things, if you take care of the light, the sound and the stability of your shot and if you just kind of give us basically this kind of shot, a person looking straight into the, um, uh, into the camera speaking, then that's really all we're, all we're after for this project. So good luck and I look forward to seeing your clips. See ya.